78. <laughs> PBS presents NASL Championships. Ed Durang and sends it in. A shot and goal. Ball in and the shot taken and scored. It was a magical time uh, and, and having a team of, of, of stars that played uh, together in Fort Lauderdale and played against teams like the Cosmos and and the Rowdies and, and all around the league. Uh, the Strikers became one of the marquee franchises in the league because of all the uh, big name players uh, that we had at the time. I think Fort Lauderdale was put on the international map um, to a great extent by the Strikers. I believe it was in 78, within a span of just a few weeks, you had Nanny Kubias, Gerd Mueller, and George Best all brought in. And, you know, we saw very early that they were committed and, and we really learned about these players and people rallied to that. I remember playing in front of uh, 40 plus thousand fans. Uh, the, the first striker teams in 77 and 78 were, were American players and primarily British players. And then suddenly uh, we started throwing a, an international flavor into the, into the side. Uh, Nene Cadillas, uh, came on board fresh off being the top scorer in the World Cup for Peru in 1978. The flair that he brought uh, to the Strikers team right away uh, changed the way the team played, uh, the South American style. And then, of course, Gerd Muller. Uh, Gerd was just a, a great goal scorer, a great teammate, uh, never played selfishly in any way, shape, or form, was all about winning. And, uh, and really just a class, a class individual. Ray Hudson was a mainstay on the team and Ray was a playmaker and a goal scorer. His playmaking abilities, I think, were always in the forefront in those years. I think the Strikers have a, have a great opportunity uh, to uh, relight the soccer fire uh, on a professional level here in South Florida. And so we're going to do everything uh, possible to uh, rekindle that flame, and I think it's going to it's going to work. It's going to uh, be a labor of love. It's going to take time, but I but uh, we're uh, we have our heart set on on getting that accomplished, and we're going to get it accomplished.